on the time here is seven o'clock in the evening we are uh, march 30 which is tuesday evening may i greet everyone a pleasant good morning to you guys whenever you are here in australia we are on evening maybe in your end you are late afternoon or early morning in united states have a time difference seven o'clock in the morning in in africa it's 11 o'clock in the morning in dubai it's midday so forgive me if i say good evening to everyone this is wilhelmina ford here wilhelmina is a a seller's marketing consultant and mandate at the same time your business facilitator now most of you wonder why wilhelmina is everywhere on youtube channel and on facebook that is a really very good question the answer is we are now on social media we do sell our product through online Wilhelmina is the extension office of Konakri seller. Wilhelmina extension office of Bamako Mali seller and Shira Leon. We have gold and diamond. <clears throat> My job is to screen you. My job is to accept your order. Our full corporate offer already in front of you. On this video, there's a link. I want you to click when you are looking for supply because uh, you will never get supply if you are just roaming around and chasing most of you are window shopping because we are now on social media you can window shop on youtube channel <clears throat> you can window shop on facebook <clears throat> facebook is a social advertising site you can buy products on Facebook I did purchase this um, blood pressure through Facebook and I did purchase recently phone stick yeah I purchased recently through Facebook I purchased four of those four of these for me to bring it to my boss in Mali and in Conakry and Sierra Leone. I am giving my boss, my head office, this stick. Can you see that? Uh -huh. You can do the selfie selfie. Okay. So I purchased this for me to travel again to Africa and I'm going to give this to my head office. Uh -huh. Now, Wilhelmina based in Australia. I am an extension digital office in Australia. You will never find a person who provide everything online. Most of you, 98% come to Wilhelmina's online store because I'm the only person who put everything online we have gold on conakry we have gold and diamond in conakry guinea we have gold and diamond in Sierra Leone, and we have gold and diamond in bamako mali bamako mali and conakry and Sierra Leone are producer of precious mineral may i recall few few days ago during my live video i watched the presentations of the ambassador from switzerland she was a guest speaker of uh, i think there was a conference about uh, promoting the country between africa and switzerland the ambassador the lady says to the president Mr. President, we from Switzerland, we are buying raw materials in Africa. 
we are buying cocoa and we are buying gold and other precious mineral which is raw materials now most of you misunderstood wilhelmina most of you misunderstood that you don't like to deal to buy products on social media i think you made a mistake because social media is the way to find the supply most of you who come to me are all joker broker mm -hmm. pretending to be a buyer and you're gonna see well amina i have the buyer and how much is my commission i beg your pardon the reason why well amina put on social media because we would like to eliminate doji broker and doji buyer what is the cost of buyers and seller fail because too many chain of broker three or four brokers and one buyer and then you're gonna ask commission there is no profit margin for the buyer there is no profit margin for the seller because there is valued added tax and the buyer needs to get the profit the buyer has to pay the products before he's gonna take the product to his destination and there is a valued added tax as well and the buyer has an importation tax when he bring this raw material to his own country and my seller will pay his government valued added tax as well before you will get the export documentation the ownership of the gold the ownership of the diamond you will never get diamond or gold without payment without export documentation you're gonna say oh i don't want to pay upfront there is no upfront here there's none just a moment someone sending me a message bio wants to get the gold in conakry just bear with me <clears throat> Uh -huh. Yeah, I have spoken with you once, twice on WhatsApp in Kunakli, difficult place. Okay, it's not a difficult place in Kunakli. Just a moment, I'm gonna call this guy. Uh -huh. The reason why you find difficulty because you're too many chain of broker good good evening abayani ah, good day, madam. yes how are you today well i'm fine i'm alive i'm alive you you leave a message on my whatsapp that uh, you have a friend wanting to buy gold in conakry guinea is that right um yes uh, that's a, it's even on the ground at uh, conakry now but uh Oh, you see, uh, I'm just trying to be careful because we have a, uh, you know, we have uh, bad people there. <laughs> Why bad so people, people there? Ask you to bring money. No, the real yeah, seller would not ask, you know, ask like that. No. Uh, you see, uh, for example, one of them has a. Uh, my contact to bring money yeah to go and bring a uh, 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 go from their minds so at the end of the day paying him money up front is never done anywhere in the world i don't see your gold want to sell to me and uh, instead of him to carry the go to him and say tested and say that, that is wrong. That is wrong. Completely wrong. That is wrong. That is wrong. May I explain to you? May I explain to you properly? In Conakry, the gold okay. coming from the mines, which is 10 hours drive to Conakry. Shigiri is the okay. is the main source of gold. And then you're gonna ask your friend maybe your friend has a difficulty because he's he think that he can get cheap price no way when my seller okay. let me finish eh? when my seller okay. 
bring the gold from the mines because my seller owned the concession. He has to hire the security guard to escort the gold from the village to Konakri in order for the gold to brought to the office. And my seller will hire the escort security because there's a lot of hold uping on the way from the mines to the city. And it takes 10 hours drive. So your buyer, I think he has a wrong perception because the real seller would not ask you upfront. We don't ask. We have the gold. You come to the office, but your buyer is already on the ground. We don't entertain buyers already on the ground. No. I've been to Conakry 2019 and last year, March. I was in Conakry several times and I met a lot of buyers. We don't have... We don't uh, entertain buyers with no invitation. May I tell you, the reason why we are very strict. This is million dollars you're okay. buying. There is this is money. Yes. There are so many it's fake money. buyers. So many. I met uh, the fake money. buyer okay. face to face in Conakry in Sierra Leone. Ah. Face to face. Okay. That is the reason why okay. they are they are um, encountering disaster. This is money you're buying, my dear. This is not banana. This is not bread. <laughs> this is not bread. Yeah. Even bread. Even bread. You cannot take the bread from the from the bakery without a dime. Yeah. I I don't know why you people travel with no planning. You, you know me, you know Wilhelmina. I've been to Africa. You will never get gold from us. If Aguilamina would not end screen your buyer. Oh no, you would not, never. There is no upfront here. You have to pay for it. Mm. You have to place an order. Inspect. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. I, what I will do is that I will introduce you to one of the associates is in Dubai. Okay. Now, take from there, he will talk to you. So, and have a, a, a way forward. We like so, that. I'll do it right now. Mm -hmm. um, I, I will do it right now. And they will talk for, um, uh, with you over there. You, now, you must remember. They, they, they have, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> and, you know, they, uh, they are in uh, Dubai. But the other associates, they are, they are in Conakry now. So, and I want you to help me, you know, tell them to the right source. Okay, you I want to talk to your buyer. I want to. I want to talk to your buyer. And I doubt your buyer is already in Conakry. I doubt he would, he would not able to get the gold. I doubt. Maybe he was being offered very cheap. Uh -huh. Yes, I doubt because the real seller would not deal. Uh, Konakri is very, very strict. Very strict. Yes, I even met a Singaporean when I was in Konakri. I stayed at the Kulum Hotel. A Singaporean. He was there for one month. Ah, he didn't get the gold because his term is not acceptable. Nah, gold is money you're buying. Uh, yeah. Uh, you will never. I can tell you. Go, go about it. Sorry? Because, uh, you see, I say, how do you normally go about it? Well, uh, your buyer has to like introduce himself. In Nigeria. Well, your buyer has to say. In Nigeria. Yeah, I know you are in Nigeria and your uh, buyer is from Dubai, but your buyer yeah. has to introduce himself because I would like to interview your buyer, whether he's a buyer or not. Uh, Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah. 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 I don't I believe. Will, I will do that. Okay. I, do. I really don't believe uh, buyers and blah blah blah. I have to I screen your buyer. To them. Yeah. Well, I cannot help yeah, you. No problem. Yeah. It's not a problem. All right. Nice uh, talking to you. I will do that right now. Because I'm live yeah, at the moment. Yeah. I would be. I on. I'm very busy yeah. right now because I'm live on my Facebook. Because I'm explaining about how okay. this buyer uh, um, able to get the supply in Sierra Leone. 
father and son trapped in Sierra Leone. Yeah. And I'm going to explain live. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. Okay, sorry I was been interrupted. Okay. My dear international buyer, don't be naive and do not deceive yourself. You are buying million dollars here. You are buying half a million dollars worth of raw materials. Mm -hmm. Most of the big company already positioning in Africa. Big company in Perth, Australia positioning their business in Mali, positioning their business in Conakry. American big firm positioning their business all over Africa. Why? Because Africa is huge natural resources. Can you imagine this ambassador from Switzerland? She's saying that we are buying raw materials from Africa. I am not African, my dear. I am Australian, but I was born in the Philippines. I am here to assist you in order not to be duped because you were being duped. Now let us talk about so many brokers come to Wilhelmina because I am the only person who show my face and I am the only person to put everything, Conakry, Mali, and Sierra Leone. Now let us talk about Sierra Leone again. <clears throat> I just finished talking to this guy from Nigeria, and he has a representative in Conakry. Why he cannot find the gold? Mm -hmm. My question, he's already on the ground, why he cannot find the gold? The answer is, he's looking for cheap price. You know the 22 carats, our selling price, tax exclusive, tax included, our selling price is less 8% based on the world market. Now, I'll give you a scenario here. I'm going to look at the world market price, okay? Just bear with me, okay? Don't bank on it because the price of gold, it varies every 30 days. It changes every day, mm -hmm change every day. Now the price of gold today, March 30, okay, I'm going to the world market, okay. Our selling price, whether you buy gold in Sierra Leone, whether you buy gold in Conakry or in Mali, selling price is $50,000 per kilo on 22 carats. The tax is already there. There is no surprises. You don't need to pay tax. Why? I did ask my seller to waive the tax. Some of, some of the seller offer you 48% or $48,000 or $46,000 gross. You add the tax or $48,000 gross. You add the tax of 7% whatever the value of the gold on the world market times 7 percent which is three thousand three thousand eight hundred fifty per kilo right you add that one someone offer you forty eight thousand forty eight thousand plus the tax is three thousand three thousand eight hundred fifty that is already fifty one thousand dollars Fifty-one thousand eight hundred fifty, okay. Plus the shipping cost and insurance. You need to pay the shipping cost. You need to pay the cost of insurance of the gold. Before you're gonna take the gold out of the country, you need to insure it. Mm -hmm. Two percent on the total sale value, and then you're asking cheap price. You're asking forty-one. You're asking forty-eight. That is gross. Okay, we'll give you 48,000, all right, or 49, okay, plus 7% tax, plus 2% total sale value, shipping cost and insurance, which one you like? Use your calculator, Mr. Baya. 
<laughs> Use your calculator. You are you have no idea what you're doing. Uh -huh. Okay, who is this viewer? There's four viewers on my live video. I'm explaining you guys. That is the reason why this buyer already in Konakri didn't get the gold. Our selling price, Mr. Baya, we give you 8% tax inclusive. No surprises except you have to pay $100 per kilo when the good will be assay at the Central Bank of Conakry. But sometimes I might, I might consider to waive everything and there is no upfront. You have to pay for the products. Before you travel, Mr. Baya, we need to have a contract you need to place an order before we're going to issue the landing visa that you are our valued customer, that you are our special guest based on your order. Let's say you order 20 kilos, we will reserve that in the office. Mm -hmm. So when you arrive, the contract has already been signed. You're going to produce your business registration. You're going to show us your passport copy. You're going to show us your proof of fund. What's the purpose? What's the point? We're going to issue the landing visa to travel, and you don't have the money to pay for it. Because this is FOB bank to bank. And there is no upfront. You have to pay for it. You inspect the gold in the office, and then you like it, you make a down payment. It's not upfront. Forget about the word upfront. You already signed a contract, right? You inspect the 20 kilos or 50 kilos or 100 kilos in the office. You bring your gold taster. You taste it before the gold will be brought to the central bank. So my seller says, okay, well, Amina, you brought the buyer. What would be the next? Because I was in the head office in Conakry. My transaction was successful. I was with the buyer. I took the buyer with me, but I give the buyer a really good price because the buyer did pay my extra service. Yes, if you don't want my extra service, I'll give you 8% your travel, but I will monitor your movement. But if I am with you, I might be able to give you 10%. <laughs> but my extra service is not for free. So you are paying my extra service to cover my travel cost. In return, I will give you back the, the percentage. Instead of 8%, I might be able to give you 2 extra point, 2% extra in total of 10%. So there is no surprises. But if you are dealing with chain of broker, Mr. Buyer, we don't pay double commission. We give you directly commission, directly profit. Mm -hmm. My salary is paying Wilhelmina's work. That's why you come to Wilhelmina. Because you would never, never find a person like Wilhelmina. This is my office. I am here to interview you guys. I am here to validate you. Remember when you apply for a job? You will be interviewed whether you are suited to that position that you're applying exactly the same. Well, Amina is interviewing you whether you are capable to pay the gold. So what happened? You filed. I just uh, having a conversation from India. He wanted a diamond. I just finished having a conference 35 minutes ago. Mm hmm and he, I saw his uh, Facebook profile. Yeah, he works at Diamond. He works. And he said he is a buyer. I just finished having a conference with him. And he said, if I'm in Freetown, madam, can I come and see your seller? I said, yeah, you can see, but there is a but. Before you will see my seller, you have to place an order. Because my seller's instruction, he would not entertain buyers already in Freetown. Why? I've been to Freetown. I meet a lot of fake buyers. Yeah? 
you are a buyer but you have limited cash you have a little bit of money you want to pay the diamond cif cost insurance and freight only but how about paying the diamond the diamond cannot leave the country of origin without kimberly certificate that the diamond free of blood diamond so if you have less capital and then you're asking cif i can guarantee you you fell 100 percent because the department of mines would not issue the certificate of clearance that you did pay the diamond to the owner in order to reflect the receipt of payment the owner of this diamond he will show it to the department of mines that you did pay their property without that you will never never get the diamond the diamond you need a kimberly certificate called kpc that the diamond is free of blood diamond without that i can guarantee you you are going to encounter disaster yes there's so many buyers wanting to buy but when i interview them oh they are time waster i call them joker just on sometimes i have another a buyer hey will you able to assist me with advertising selling 100 i'm not an agency i'm located in south africa north camp north northern cape kuruman yeah my dear i'm not <laughs> i'm not an agency i work for the seller i am here to sell the production of my seller we are the seller i am the extension office of the seller i am not an agency i am here to guide you i am here to assist you in order for you not to be duped mm -hmm. that is the story ronnie ronnie oakland ronnie good evening ronnie okay just a moment ronnie is here okay ronnie okay okay good evening Thank you. Thank you for thank you for dropping by. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, as you know, I'm live. I would like you to ask questions so that those buyers, the, those potential buyers, would also understand that this gold and diamond purchase. It's not easy if you don't have the money. It would be easy if you have cash. Now, going back to my explanation, you do, some of you, um, of your uh, people, some of the brokers, they don't believe on Facebook. Huh? Facebook, there are 6.6 .6 billion followers. I'll tell you. I saw an advertisement on Facebook carpet cleaner their office is in south side so I have a big rug I need to wash my rug so I contacted that uh, uh, advertisement through Facebook my rug was picked up and wash it into their factory and it bring it back to my home in north side in Brisbane and I'm satisfied. Where did I found this carpet cleaner? From Facebook. Where did I put this one? This one? This um, language interpreter? From Facebook. Where did I put this uh, stick for phone? From Facebook. Where did I put this blood pressure? From Facebook. Everything now is online. And then you guys, you don't believe on Facebook. Well, you are on Facebook. Yeah, you are on Facebook. 
Wilhelmina is on Facebook. This is my online store. You can find Wilhelmina on YouTube channel. I have a huge YouTube channel. I have channel. I have 1.9 follower on my YouTube channel. Uh -huh. This uh, live video video on Facebook would be linked to my YouTube channel. Some people doesn't like to come to Facebook. They go on YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. So, Mr. Buyer, if you don't have the money, don't waste your time. Because gold will not come to you and diamond would not come to you. Now, going back to this buyer from India, he wanted diamond. Mm -hmm. And he want to come to Sierra Leone. I said, yeah, you can come to Sierra Leone at any time. But we don't entertain buyers without knowing who you are. Because there's so many hold up as well foreigners. There's so many foreigners that stand by in in Sierra Leone just like a bigger. I met a guy he married to a Filipina and he traveled to Sierra Leone to buy gold, small uh, item. And he bring the gold to Dubai, he pay cash. There's only one kilo, two kilos. But he has his own supplier. You know what he told me? Madam, you are the only person who explained thoroughly, and I was being duped in Ghana before <laughs> this gentleman. He was being duped in Ghana. I was even duped in Ghana before. That's why I don't want to touch Ghana, because Ghana is notorious. The sellers are notorious. They are deceitful. They are devious. That is why I would not tell, I would not bring buyer in Ghana. I prepare to bring buyer to Conakry, I prepare to bring buyer to Mali, I prepare to bring buyer to Sierra Leone with me. Uh -huh. So the buyer, the, this gentleman, he's from Lebanon, married to a Filipina, and he said, you are the only person who explained thoroughly, you are real. You know how much the price he purchased gold in Sierra Leone? is $50,000 per kilo. Yes. And you guys asking 48, asking 36. 36 is 12 carats. Most Indians are asking cheap price. One Indian, he come to me. We send him the landing visa. This Indian, and he doesn't want to meet my seller, but he got the landing visa. He was window shopping, window shopping, buying diamond, I think, three stone. So he arrived in in Sierra Leone or Freetown and my seller said madam the buyer is already here I said really I think his name here his name is Hindam it is mm -hmm. and I said to it is what are you doing why you don't want to see my seller and my seller paid $100 for the landing visa and he was window shopping and he was offered cheap price what happened he lost money and then he come back. He come back to to me and asked my seller to help him. I said, no, you are a deceitful Indian. Another Indian, I met him in Dubai. He come to my hotel at Royal, at, um, at my hotel, Holiday Inn, close to the airport. He said he's going to fly to Freetown. He, he discussed with the seller. He was offered during the time last, that was last year. He was offered $38,000. And I told him, you know, I just been to Sierra Leone. You would fail if you don't have the cash. So he didn't tell me that he doesn't have the money. So he went there and his uh, seller rejected him. And then he asked me if I could help him. So I'm very kind and generous. So I contacted my seller. This uh, Indian who lives in Dubai has no money. Is asking for CIF. My gosh, you guys, do not be involved if you don't have the money. Do not. Because this is money you are buying, and then you don't have the money, and then you're going to ask us to bring the gold to Dubai. What happened? Gold will not leave the country of origin without certification, without export documentation. Another failure. Another father and son, he knows me for six months. They went to Sierra Leone. 
he was been duped. He knows me, and then when he was duped, he called me. Madam, please help us. I said, what can I do for you, father and son? So, oh, you've been talking to me six months ago. Why? How come? You are in Sierra Leone. Oh, yeah, we were been talking to uh, the seller. They offer us $38,000. Okay? And what happened? The gold didn't arrive in Dubai. I said, why? We paid taxes. That is wrong. Why you pay taxes and you have not paid the gold? Mm -hmm. This is live video call have father and son. And then they have an agent, local agent. The local agent deceived this father and son from India. And then he said to me, please, madam, you know me. I said, no, I don't know you. Help us. No, I'm not. You're creating your own mess. I cannot help you because our policy, we don't entertain buyers with no invitation the reason why we don't entertain you guys when we invite you you are exclusively for my seller my seller will issue the lending visa for you so you only meet my seller you're gonna stay in Sierra Leone, Conakry or Mali nine working days only because we prepare your order so most of you, the one to top corner, you were being excited, and then you come to Wilhelmina. I am not a babysitter. I'm not. Wilhelmina is not a babysitter. We are here to deal directly to the buyer in order for Wilhelmina to assist the buyer so that the buyer would be satisfied and the buyer will come back. That is the reason why we do this. And that is the reason why Wilhelmina is trying to eliminate most of the time waster. I call them Joker Broker Online. Mm -hmm. Last night, I have four people. One from Mauritius, and one from Kenya, and one from Conakry. And they say that they have a buyer already staying at the Royal Column across the road, the central bank. Mm -hmm. Immediately, I turn it down. I told them that we don't do business like that. So your buyer is already on the ground in Kanakri. How come he couldn't find the gold and why you come to Alamina? My seller's office from central bank, it's eight blocks away. I've been to Kunakri, you must remember, so you cannot fool me. I've been to Sierra Leone, mm -hmm. and I'm about to travel to Mali to bring this buyer. Unfortunately, Australia is locked down at the moment. So because we are locked down, I will monitor your movement. I will guide you. You can travel to Mali by my guidance. Now, I already explained it. The procedure on Kanakri and Sierra Leone. Now let's talk about Bamako Mali. Mm -hmm. Bamako Mali is the third largest gold producer in West Africa. Going back to Conakry, Conakry is the land of opportunity. There's a lot of company there in Africa, Conakry, Mali, and Sierra Leone. Chinese own hotels. Chinese, they are everywhere we own the big hotels they own a big company the hotel i'm staying belong to the chinese chinese is the owner mm -hmm. now let's talk about conakry again before you're gonna get gold in conakry you have to place your order called loi letter of intent to purchase coming from you mr buyer not cut and paste. I have rejected hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of cut and paste from chain of joker broker. We don't pay double commission. We don't. My seller hired Wilhelmina. And we don't pay double commission. I prepare to deal directly to the buyer. We give the buyer a very good deal. Understand, Mr. Buyer, you're watching Wilhelmina. Now let's go back to Bamako Mali. Bamako Mali has three refineries, two private 
refinery. KMR and Marina. My seller wouldn't deal KMR and Marina. So my seller only deal with DNG, which is the government refinery. The two private refinery, they came to Mali 2016. That is business. That is private. They are there to open a refinery. They are also a buyer. They refine the gold into gold volume and then sell it to their own customer. They are buying gold in Mali, a raw material which is dory bar. Listen very carefully, Mr. Baya. You are not buying 24 carats. You are not buying gold volume here. You are buying 23 carats dory bar. You can refine it into gold volume. You know that, Mr. Baya. Your buyer is a refinery. So refinery knows how to refine. Refinery knows how to make into 24 carats. So don't deceive yourself. Do not. Everything is on my virtual page. If you read it, I would believe you're a buyer. Yes, we have tons of gold. Conakry, Mali, and Sierra Leone. But how are you able to get it? And then you're asking, you're going to buy through Treasury Bond? You are going to buy CIF, cost insurance and freight only? So therefore, you don't have the money. You cannot afford to pay the products. Why are you going to pay cost insurance and freight only? Why? Why not paying the gold? That is normal. You have to pay the shipping cost. That is normal. You have to pay the insurance you need to insure the gold. What happens if the gold leaves the country of origin and the gold has been stolen? So who is the fault? You. So therefore, you have to insure that. 1% of the shipping cost, 1% of the insurance in total of 2%. Mm -hmm. Outselling price, LDMA, you must remember, 8%. Mm -hmm. So now, Mr. Baya, I, um, I would like to share with you that I had a buyer that has been dealing with us for 98 days and he signed a contract. Mm -hmm. And he signed a contract, he said he is a buyer. He was been waiting and waiting and waiting for him. We have been waiting for him to comply the contract. We provide him SKR, we provide him the the information of the security company and the taxes and everything. We put that on paper. For 98 days, this buyer is really deceiving. And the contract, we terminated the contract. We cannot wait for the buyer to, to wait for him for 98 days. We send him a letter that we were giving him an extension. And on the following, on the 26th, the contract has been terminated. I'm just sharing you with you here. So that the future buyer would not muck around. Mm -hmm. Now, Mr. Buyer, if you are really serious buyer, we have tons of gold. We have. We don't deal treasury bond, right? We don't deal SBLC. Now, the contract, he submitted it to the bank. The bank says, okay, everything's done. But this buyer is playing games with us. Yeah. So... I myself advised the seller, what can we do? I did ask my head office in Mali to give this buyer another extension. But 26, the extension was over. We terminated the contract. We don't care about this buyer that he has million dollars. Gold is money. Yeah, gold is money. Your paper money has no value. You must remember. Mm. You must remember that the your paper money has no value. Gold has a value. You get the lighter. You burn your paper money. Your paper money will be vanished just like that. But you smelt the rock with its gold. When it is smelt, it's still gold. So which one you like? That is the reason why the Central Bank of Switzerland did travel to Africa. They buy raw materials. Why this um, mining company in Perth 
We are in Mali. We are in Conakry. We are everywhere. Why Chinese are there in Africa? Why? And you, pretending to be a buyer, what a waste of time. You're a time waster. Mm -hmm. That is the reason why I'm here. Now, I receive a lot of LOI. Mm -hmm. Okay? This LOI coming from Mitchell. Cut and paste. Cut and paste. How many LOI I received in the past? A thousand. I rejected it. Mr. Baya, may I educate you? I'm in front of you. Listen very carefully. This is for your own benefit. Not for me. I am here to help you. I am here to assist you. When you send a letter of intent, you need to specify what carrot, what purity you are looking for, which destination, and your refinery address, and the mode of payment. This is not LC. This is not block fund. This is FOB. December 11, my head office shipped the gold in Turkey one ton. February 15, my head office deliver gold in Dubai 200 kilos FOB. 50 kilos delivered again in Dubai FOB. And you floating around and floating around thinking you will get the gold thinking the gold will come to you no the gold and diamond will not come to you you have to place an order for Wilhelmina to validate you don't be scared mr Bayer. don't i am here to assist you before we gonna do the transaction mr Bayer, you already saw the full corporate offer on Wilhelmina's virtual page on Facebook very extensively read it digest it we have gold and diamond take time and relax when you are ready you come back then you send me a formal letter of intent coming from you Mr. Bayer not cut and paste I would reject any LOI cut and paste Especially, I want to know who is the main buyer. If you're acting on behalf of your buyer, Mr. Broker, your buyer is paying you. We don't pay double commission. We call that two tiers. Mm -hmm. We don't pay double commission. We give the buyer a discount because the buyer will get the profit. Not you, Mr. Broker. No. My seller is paying Wilhelmina's work. That's why you meet Wilhelmina. This is my online store. I am the extension of the seller. So you don't need to room around, cut and paste. And if you're a buyer's mandate, your buyer is paying you. Because you cannot find the gold. You will find the gold through Wilhelmina because Wilhelmina is here. The full corporate offer is in front of you. If you are really wise buyer, click on every link. It will open the gold for Konakri. Click on Mali. You will see tons of gold. But you are not paying attention. You're not. You just run, 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 excited. No, I'm not excited to meet you. I would be excited when you present yourself properly i'm not excited at all to me i will consider you a joker if you're not paying attention i'm sorry if i'm very very blunt i'm sorry if i i'm very brutal people doesn't like wilhelmina too bad because i don't want you to make the same mistake i know you were been duped before there's so many foreigners has been duped. Even myself, I was been duped in Ghana. I was been screwed both buyers and sellers in Ghana. Screwed by Salvan Kanwar, screwed by Eric Blasco from Mexico. That was my bad experience. I am sharing you here. So Mr. Bayer, don't 
don't be deceitful don't be devious as well you are a businessman you must have your own capital we don't take your money from your bank just show us your bank statement that you have a value of your order you have a half a million of 10 kilos yeah that is already half a million but if you're gonna say oh i want to buy gold cif no upfront pay excuse me if i saying this do not be bullshitting <laughs> yes this is million dollars you're buying no one is giving you for nothing nobody is giving you for free even my seller would not give his gold without payment yeah so think about it mr Biden. in dubai there's so many joker buyer when i was in dubai every time i travel to africa i always stop over in dubai many times i met a lot of joker buyer in dubai they're pretentious so oh, we are the buyer i said okay if you're a buyer how long have you been searching for gold oh there's so many scammer define me the word is come i told this indian you cannot define what is the meaning of scam. Scam means you're dishonest. I'll give you an example. What is the meaning of scam? Remember Jesus Christ had 12 disciples. Judas is the scammer. He deceived Jesus Christ. He sold Jesus Christ of 17 sterling just to lie. Uh -huh. And Peter and Thomas didn't believe when Jesus Christ was resurrected. That is also deceiving. Right? I'm just giving you an example on the base on the Bible. So do not deceive yourself. Because Wilhelmina is not deceiving you. I am teaching you in a proper way because we would like to deal with you in a straight way, not on a crooked way. Uh -huh. If you are scared, well, don't be involved in gold business. If you don't believe Africa, don't buy. Uh -huh. I'm telling you because I interviewed a lot of time waster. How many people I rejected? Thousands since 2011. That is the reason why I bring the buyer with me in order to bring it to the office, inspect the order, you like it, you make your payment. It's not upfront. You make your payment, maybe a commitment, just like to buy a property, right? I used to be in real estate. I was number seven in real estate here in Brisbane. When a buyer come to our office, I ask the buyer, have you been to the bank to have a pre-loan, pre-approval? Yes, madam, we've been to the bank. How much the bank approve you? What? how much you are looking for how many bedrooms what is your budget oh three hundred fifty thousand dollars so i know the buyer where i to put where i put the buyer to a cheaper suburb 350 because here in brisbane we have suburbs by suburb cheap or middle class or rich suburb mm -hmm. buying gold exactly the same i am the one who will interview you I'm the one who will reject you. I'm the one. And I'm the one who will advise my head office to proceed, not to proceed. I had rejected hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of doji buyer. And most of the broker doesn't like Wilhelmina. Why? Because I'm too frank. It's better to be frank rather than to be deceitful. Mm -hmm. I don't want to deceive you because I was being deceived by people. I was. That is why I learn in a hard way. You learn from Wilhelmina, from the University of Hard Knocks, of Wilhelmina's virtual store. What you see on my virtual store, what you get on actual. We have gold and diamond. I think I already explained it. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to summarize before i'm going to close buying gold has the procedure buying gold you need a capital buying gold and diamond you need to be ready to travel and you need to place an order we have gold and diamond on my virtual page 
Mm -hmm. Just select which video because we are now putting video to video in order for you to view directly from your lounge room. Mm -hmm. We don't send picture anymore with your name. No. What you see, that is real. What you see on, on my virtual store, when you arrive, you will see the gold and diamond. So if you want to, ch to change the, the stone, we will put the stone on the table. You can select the stone. But make sure you must have available at least sixty to $100,000. It's not worth it for you to travel. If you don't have $60,000 minimum, and then you're going to travel to buy one stone, please don't. It's not worth it for you to travel, to stay in the hotel, it costs money. To fly to Africa, it costs money. You know how much I do charge my travel cost? If I'm going to mention it right now in front of you, my, you might fall over on your chair. That is normal. You have to pay for it. In return, instead of 8%, I'm going to give you 10%. So at the end of the day, you are a winner rather than talking to a chain or broker joker. I call them joker. Because once they saw my posting, they're excited. Read. Read. Digest it. Then you come back, Wilhelmina. We understand what we are looking for now. What would be the next, Wilhelmina? Very simple. You already saw the requirement, what you need. What you have to do, you send me your business registration. Because I want to see it. Because I don't know you. You already saw Wilhelmina, so therefore you know Wilhelmina. And you click in front of you the link. You will see the full corporate offer. You will see the diamond. Then number two, you're going to send me your importation license. And number three, your passport copy. Number four, show me that you have a proof of fund the value of your order and if you just fly to conakry fly to mali fly to sierra leone without preparation i wouldn't be able to entertain you at all yes so what a waste of time now mr buyer this is for you instead of roaming around and roaming around collecting information you know you're gonna be called mr buyer if you are not very careful you are information launderer. Most of the broker are information launderer. Why? They launder my information. They cut and paste. They launder and solicit by a we call that online launderer. Just like money laundering. Just like gold laundering. Be honest if you're a buyer's mandate. Be honest. Mr. Buyer, I think you already know that your business would not function without the supply. There's a saying, supply and demand determine the price, Mr. Baya. You must remember, don't be scared with Wilhelmina. Do not. Be lucky that you meet Wilhelmina. I can guarantee you, I can assure you, you will get what you are looking for. But, prove to me, that you have a standby capital in your bank account. Prove to me that you have proof of fund, your bank statement. When you prove it to me, I can assure you, you will get the gold. And I will ask my head office to give you a very flexible price, but not a chain of broker. The chain of broker, oh, how much is my commission? I want 3%, I want 4%. There is no profit margin why are we gonna give the broker three percent we're gonna give it to the sell to the buyer my seller is paying me i don't need you guys i don't need chain of broker joker i don't that is why this is my online store i'm very frank i'm very strict because mr buyer i want you to get supply from us we are the seller my seller own the gold my seller own the concession. Yeah? You can see the video of Mali, Conakry, and Sierra Leone. That is real. 
we have this KR. But I would not release this KR at all. Unless you convince me, you showed me your proof of fun. Yes, I will attach this KR on the contract only. Thank you very much. Have a pleasant good evening. I shall wait for you on conference.